Hey friends, in the previous video, we built a calculator app using Gradio. The app allowed users to input two numbers and select an operation like addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division from a dropdown. Based on the selected operation, it performed the calculation and displayed the result. Now we're switching gears a bit. This time we'll create a simple app that analyzes text files. The app will allow users to upload a text file and it will count the number of words in that file. Let's dive into how we can do that step-by-step. Step. We're gonna make some changes to the input and output sections of the app. Instead of using the number inputs and dropdown, we'll switch to a file upload input. I'll use gr.file to allow the user to upload a text file. For the output, we'll use a gr.textbox to display the word count result. Let's update the code and see how this change allows us to handle file uploads and display the result in a text box. Now that we've made the changes to the input and output, let's launch the app and see the updates in action. I'll run the app in the web browser where you'll be able to upload a text file. Once the file is uploaded, the app will process the content and display the word count in the text box. Now, let's dive into the function together. First, I'm going to update the function name to analyze text. Next, I'll change the parameter from the previous example to file, which will allow us to handle the file that the user uploads. In the function, I'll use file.name to get the file's temporary path, since Gradio returns the file as a named string object. This gives us the ability to access and read the file. Then I'll open the file with with open text r encoding equals utf-8 and read its content using f.read. This ensures that I correctly process the text, especially for files with special characters. Finally, I'll split the content into words using content.split and count them, which gives us the total word count in the file. This will be displayed as the result. Now that we've updated the function to analyze text, I'm going to change the function in the interface as well by setting fn equals analyze text. This makes sure the app uses the correct function for processing the uploaded text file. Next, I'll explain that we'll be using a text.txt file that is already in the project directory. This is the file we'll be analyzing to count the number of words. Once the file is selected, I click the Submit button, and the app processes the content and calculates the word count. As you can see, the word count for this file is 6. I hope this helps. In the next video, we'll continue building more cool apps. See you then.